would highly recommend and suggest you all, if you have a chance to read some of his material, do the same because you, you will only become smarter. I promise you, you will only become smarter by watching and listening and learning to, uh, to Glenn. And uh, I'm, I'm delighted to have him with us today um, on the call. So, uh, Glenn, are you there? Yes, I am. Thank you, Bob. That's very kind. Oh, my pleasure, Glenn. So, so I'm gonna, uh, Glenn. I'm gonna hand it over to you. And I said uh, to everybody, um, what what I'd like him, them all to do is to go ahead and, and type in questions if they have anything for you, and we can kind of, you know, stop from time to time uh, during the presentation, and you can we can we can hit the questions up, or we can just wait till the end as well too. So, uh, uh, but I'm gonna uh, as of now, right, Glenn, I'm just gonna go ahead and, and make you the uh, make you the presenter and. Uh, um, we're on our way. Well, thank you, um, and welcome, everybody. My name is Glenn Williams. I write for Real Money, uh, The Street, and I stay in the energy sector. Um, and today we're going to talk about solar, and solar power in particular. And I'd like to draw a distinction. There's utility-grade solar, and then there's rooftop solar. And today we're going to be talking mostly about utility solar. And uh, we can talk about rooftop uh, a little bit later in questions if you'd like, but I think you're going to see why in a minute. Um, so here we go. There are a lot of myths out there about uh, solar, and uh, one is that it's a fad and it's going to go away. Util people don't like it. Uh, it's unprofitable. Uh, consumers uh, have to pay too much money for it. It's just another political program. And requires enormous federal subsidies or it won't work and it's destroying the nation's utility system. Every one of those are myths and every one of those are absolutely not true. And you're going to see in a minute why. I think you may be surprised by some of the, some of the uh, facts here. So the big winner in solar power, particularly uh, even rooftop, are state governments. And, uh, and we're going to do a deep dive on the state in a few minutes. State, individual states win up big in utility grade solar and actually rooftop solar as well. But believe it or not, taxpayers and consumers win too. People think that taxpayers are paying a fortune for, for um, solar, um, solar panels and wind and so on. And they also think consumers are paying way too much uh, for, for the service. <laughs> 